Hey you guys, today I'm going to talk about Bad Girls Club um, Redemption, thir Season 13, Episode 4. I'm not going in order. I'm just going to talk about some things that happen on the show. If we get through everything, great, but okay. The relevant stuff. We're going to start with that first. Danny's birthday. It's Danny's birthday. She says in some kind of way because her sister's not there. I can get that. Being a twin, that's the only thing I can get from her. But, um, yeah, it's her birthday, and they go out and they celebrate her birthday. She feels some kind of way because Judy and Sarah got her a cake or whatever. I don't even like cake, but she was eating, motherfucker. Girl, shut up. But, um, yeah, they got our cake, whatever. They end up going to the club. Everybody except Judy and Sarah. Happy birthday, Danny. The other relevant part was the life coach. The life coach came to the house. I don't understand. I don't, it's fourth episode. These girls ain't really too much working on anything. People could say Camilla is working on shit, but she's really, really not. And I'll get into that in a minute. But, um... So she comes, she talks to, I think she talks to, um, we see her talk to, I remember her talking to Jada, and Jada ended up getting mad, I think, because she ended up bringing up her father's situation, Jada didn't want to talk about it, whatever situation was, Jada didn't want to talk about it, Jada walks out, Laura goes and catches her, bring her back in the room and apologize for the way... I guess the way she said it, I don't think Laura really apologized for her coming at her because she's trying to bring things out of her that she really don't want to talk about. And I get that. It's some things you want to talk about on camera, but then it's some things you don't. But I'm like, boo, this is what you signed up for. So, hey, um, who else she talked to? I don't know because it was really that irrelevant of her coming to the house. Camilla... She talked to Camilla, um, and Camilla was talking, why did Camilla have that on? Why did she have, on? Um, I'm going to the White House for tea outfit? I didn't get it. Trying to act like she's working on herself, girl boo. But she said she's working on herself. She ain't beating nobody up yet, so I guess that's working on yourself, Camilla. Okay. Um, to me, I'm sorry. Camilla is doing the same fucking thing Natalie is doing. Getting other bitches to fight her battles. She is. With the beginning, Natalie saying how the girls are going to see the season four in Natalie. Um, she's tired of them. All this kind of stuff. So this whole episode, well, most of the episode was this whole thing with Natalie. They feel in some kind of way about Judy and if Judy should come back and if why she she come back. Pros and cons with Natalie and Sarah. Then the other girls just like, I don't want to be bothered with Judy. We don't care. We can't work up on our issues. Worried about Judy. What I have said in the first three episodes. That's what I always said. Like, you bitches ain't worried about yourself. Worried about the next bitch. Okay. So, um... What I was talking, okay, my bad. I was thinking of something. But anyway, so nobody cares about Judy anymore. Judy ended up coming back, but before she can come back in the house, the producers tell her she's on probation. Anything else she do, her ass is going to go home. Soon as she walk in the house, Jada comes at her like, you need to buy me some new contacts. You need to buy me a new weave. And I'm sitting there like, bitch, please. All y'all fuck up people stuff in this house. So, and we seen that this episode. So, how you want your shit paid for? Bitch, I feel like if you come in the Bad Girls Club, you better come with the raggliest shit you can find. Because your shit is liable to get fucked up. Whether you want it to or not, it's just a liability. Your shit gonna get fucked up. Because there's some petty bitches going to be in the house. Um, so anyway, somehow, I don't even know how it was going. But I know they were talking about Judy. And uh, Camilla was getting her hair done. She took out her weave. She did her confessional about being natural and all this kind of bullshit. But she getting her hair done. And they're still talking shit about... Um, First, they were, okay, they were talking shit because 
Jada cigarettes came up missing. So everybody blamed Judy because since the contacts came up missing, Judy had to take the fucking cigarettes. And, oh, we seen Judy smoking cigarettes last night, yada, yada, yada. So Jada goes and tells Rocky. Rocky goes and confronts uh, Judy. Judy gets mad because she felt like they coming at her. So they in a confessional talking. Jada pops off like, y'all saying stuff about me. And Natalie was like, bitch, ain't nobody talking about you. Next thing you know, Camilla comes like, y'all got something to say about me. Y'all said something about me. They like, ain't nobody talking about you. So Camilla start popping off. Natalie start popping off. So Camilla getting her hair done. Natalie just talking shit like, bitch, with y'all, um, because she was talking about you a golden girl um, from season four. So Natalie like, yeah, bitch, and I'm an original. Ha. So she threw shade back at Camilla. So Camilla start crying because she's trying to keep her composure, trying not to pop off on Natalie. So that's getting red pumped up. And I'm sitting there like, Red, sit your ass down. This whole thing was irritating me because everybody was fighting. Sorry, I think my camera skipped. Sorry about that. But everybody, why is my camera doing this? I apologize, you guys. Every time I'm trying to work with another camera, Something comes up, so I apologize because I see it jumping, so it says jumping when you guys watching it. I apologize, um, but I'm going to keep it going because I don't want to have to do it all over again. And I want to get my original thoughts out of this show. So, like I said, everybody is fighting somebody else's battle. Rocky is fighting Jada's battle. Camilla just getting in the shit because she wants, she needs her camera time. Red is fighting Camilla's battle. I don't fucking get it. Uh, Natalie is fighting Judy's battle. I'm like, bitch, worry about yourself. We This house will work out fine if everybody work out their own issues. So, like I said, Natalie and Camilla is arguing. Red is over there like, I got this. Watch this. Watch, watch, watch. Natalie is over there like, fuck all y'all, I ain't worried about y'all, bitch, you getting your weave done, been done, because remember, Natalie got her weave done on season four, um, so they going back and forth, next thing you know, Rocky, oh, the phone rings, and Natalie answered it, and it's Rocky's mom, soon she says Rocky's name, Rocky snatches the phone out of Natalie's hand, so Natalie swings. Next thing you know, they pulling hair. Next thing you know, I see Red big ass swinging on, on Natalie or whatever. So they trying to Natalie trying to get her hair from Red hands or whatever, because that's what she good for pulling hair all the fucking time and falling her fat ass on the ground. Um, and in the process, Red bit Natalie. So Natalie, you know, Natalie laughing because she like, bitch, you going home, bitch, you going home. So, everybody like, oh, Natalie got beat up, woo, woo, woo. But I'm like, Natalie did not get beat up. Beat up is when bitches got bruises. We can see some shit looking like she got her ass whooped, not just pulling hair. I wish you bitches to learn how to fight. I don't know. But, yeah. So, the producers end up sending Red home for biting Natalie. And they say Natalie swung first, so she going home. I don't know if Natalie swung first. But I'm like, whatever, I guess they over the antics of all this bullshit. But I'm sitting there like, okay, now what the drama gonna be? Because now they be the show and everybody else is getting along. But no, they're gonna bully Judy and Sarah now. Sarah made a comment laughing or something. Next thing you know, they start tearing up her goddamn pictures. And I'm sitting there like, for what? They tearing up her pictures, throwing them in the pool, throwing clothes in the pool. Oh, and y'all and y'all working on yourself, right? Y'all fixing yourself, right? Okay. Okay, y'all fixing yourself. Then y'all get mad because when y'all went to lunch for Danny's birthday, then they started cheering. Camilla made a cheers to Natalie getting beat up. And Judy had a, something to say about it. Like, I don't condone violence. I don't fuss when somebody getting beat up. I don't think we should be cheering to this shit. So now they mad talking about Camilla talking about one down, two to go. So now y'all gonna play bullies, right? Now you're going to play bullies, right? Bullshit. Bullshit ass episode. Bullshit ass season. These bitches ain't working on themselves. And if y'all see these bitches working on themselves, I don't get it. I don't get it. Mm -mm. You still got Red popping off on Instagram and Facebook and shit like that. Bitch, sit down and go home 
and eat something. I don't know. Mm -mm. I don't get it. That was my episode of Bad Girls Club uh, Redemption Season 13, Episode 4. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Google+, Xbox Live. I do everything by the ghetto view, T-H-A, not T-H-E. Um, this video will probably be up sometime in the morning because somehow my Wi-Fi is so messed up where it's taking a long time um, with this camera to upload. So, um, yeah. Make sure you check out Ashley Miller and some more love and um, Scotty from Mr. Still Standing. Uh, Miss PTV also do um, Bad Girls Club reviews. Um, and I'll talk to you guys later. Alright, peace out.